Hoop Club TO, one of the founders right here, Akil Augustine. Akil, this joint right here that we've been involved in is incredible, man. Just talk a little bit about it. Well, I mean, we tried to share the stories that haven't been told, that people may not know, because everyone knows that Toronto has become a really bright spot in the world of basketball, from NBA number one draft picks, collegiate superstars. There's a lot of attention being paid to what's happening currently in Toronto basketball, but we wanted to bring it back to the yesteryear year and show people that not only is this one of the hot spots right now, but Toronto really has a very rich history in this game, and it's not to be ignored. The legend from Eastern Commerce, Mr. Simeon Mars. How you doing, Simeon? I'm well, thank you. Such a great uh, event that we're doing here, Who Club TO, and just to have you, you know, go through what happened here, the history of Eastern Commerce, tremendous. I'm so fortunate as, as a young man, growing up, basketball is my passion. To be able to come back, I went to school here, to be able to come back and contribute and pay forward what I've been taught and what was given to me, tremendous. You know, to work with guys like Jamal, Colin, Calvin Meikle, Aaron Grant, Mark Ambers, all these guys, so on and on, and be part of these young people realizing their dream. It, it's a gift and, and I treasure that and, and, I, and I feel so blessed to be part of that. Man, we got some W's today. We stayed on the court <laughs> for a minute. He's tired. He's, he's tired I'm right now. Right so many wins, he's tired. Talk man. about this hoop club business, what we've been doing for the last little while. Uh, last like five, six weeks, we've been doing this hoop club thing. It's like we bring some of the city's uh, influencers, you know what I'm saying, together. Play ball, we have a good time. Nike shows love, you know what I mean? I've been coming here and just getting to kind of mingle with different guys in the city, so it's dope, you know what I mean? Kind of building new relationships and stuff like that. The organization itself. It's, it's phenomenal, it, you know, Dwayne and Akil uh, and you know, the, the, the family of Nike really really putting on some sort of a, a dream to a lot of guys that, you know, you know, wanted to get to that next step, but, uh, you know, the foundation is really about the, the youth in today's, today's sport, which I'm really excited about helping build and get to the next step. This is just, it's just a love for the game, I mean, whether you're, you're good, bad, amazing, or, or you follow it religiously, it's, basketball is always going to be in me and in my family, it's, I can't let it leave me ever. I kind of came on midway through the game. This guy's rolling right now. See what happens when Akil picks a team. They end up playing like 10 games. What is it? See my man right man. <laughs> the Jimmy Butler showed up to play both sides of the ball, baby! You're one of the guys that have started this trend uh, of Canadian basketball. And look at its success. Over a dozen NBA players. We just added two more uh, this year, Trey Lyles and Olivier Hanlon. I mean, just talk about the growth of Canadian basketball. Oh, it, it's tremendous. The, the most important thing is giving young people opportunities. And not just from a basketball standpoint. Guys are able to get scholarships, to further themselves academically. You, you can realize a dream in so many different ways. And, and it's a beautiful thing. And I'm so happy to see the growth of the game in the country. Hoop Club TO, what's it all about? What is it all about for you? Uh, the free shoes, because we don't have much. Eh? I don't have shoes and I don't have money to be buying shoes. So the only reason I joined Hoop Club is to come here and get new shoes. Charlie, they are helping me. Collection looks good now. Come on. <laughs> Look at these shoes. I didn't why would I pay when you can join Hoop Club and get free shoes? I have socks now. I'm waiting for them to give us kitchen furniture and <laughs> They don't know. Hoop Club is rebuilding my whole house. Eh? <laughs> Bedroom sets. Well, one day I will come on there, but there will be a bed there for me. Yeah. Hoop Club is saving lives, Charlie.